Happening right now, a meeting is underway in St. Petersburg to decide whether the Tampa Bay Rays will continue to play in the city. Council members will decide tonight if they will set a vote on the new stadium agreement between the city, county, and the team. The deal is facing opposition from several groups. News Channel 8's Jeff Patterson joins us live from City Hall with uh, what the critics are saying. Jeff, this has been a long road, still not there yet. We have a long way to go, Josh. Just hold on. Right now, St. Petersburg City Council members are inside City Hall discussing whether or not they want to set up a vote on the agreement with the Rays. But outside, just a short time ago, people voiced their opposition to that deal. For weeks, St. Petersburg City Council members have been briefed on the details of a new stadium for the Tampa Bay Rays and a development deal for the land around the stadium. But not everyone likes the plan. We need to slow down the process so that this deal truly benefits all of us. Mike McGrath with the Sierra Club says the agreement still needs work. Right When you look at the development agreements right, right now that before City Council, um, there's not really a whole lot of strong language in there that makes sure this is actually something that's going to be a, a green building, a sustainable building, and something that can actually help to aid our community um, with the challenges we're going to have related to climate change. McGrath says the Sierra Club wants three things. A building powered by clean energy, a building that can be used to help the city recover after a major hurricane, and a site plan that restores the historic Brooker Creek. For us, we want to make sure that we have a more free-flowing creek, more green spaces, more um, natural um, riparian buffers, um, and natural embankments, right, and also a trail system within that as well. The group Faith in Florida wants more guarantees of affordable housing. Definitely, you know, we're not really against the race staying in St. Petersburg. Um, something that's come up from our chapter and the people that we organize a lot is people really, really want community control and expanded affordable housing. We have another crew inside of St. Petersburg City Council Chambers right now, and we will bring you any developments as they happen. Live in St. Pete, Jeff Patterson, 8 on your side.